Hey there everybody, welcome back to a brand new episode of Minecraft with yours truly, the Hermit Hood. Yeah, y'all caught it, y'all caught it. We got a bunch of villagers over here. I've been busy, I've been busy, and I got myself a bunch of villagers. Over here guys, we got this dude, you know, he's cutting us some slack on this. We got almost an entire set of uh, diamond armor over here. It comes with a shield, we got chainmail set almost complete. I think we can get an entire set over here of this iron yeah almost an entire set of chain mail um good deals over here good deals for days this guy over here um he's got silk touch um i want to get a, i want to get another one of those uh, i said silk touch buddy i said silk touch um am i out of books i'm out of books i'm out of books that's okay we'll go ahead we'll do this we'll grab one of these and we'll break this up. All right, let's go ahead. Let's break this up. There we go. And I'm gonna go ahead and break break this thing up a little bit here, and get myself another one of those. Hey, buddy, um, is it nighttime or something? Really? Is it nighttime? Have I been trading over here for that long? And wait, do you guys see what this looks like over here? Oh, okay, easy does it. All right, so you guys get to see all this. Um, I finally got the wheat field planted. Everything's looking good so far. I'm happy. Um, purple beds for everyone, even me. Um, can we sleep? I don't want to reset my spawn point. So, yeah, I got the wheat field planted over here that I've been wanting to do. I chopped down a lot of the trees over here for some resources. Um, that way we can do some more building over on that side. But, oh my goodness, I just loaded the world up, so we're getting a little bit of lag in this area. Um, I'm going to bring you guys down the, back over here. We're going to do a little bit more trading. I want to show you guys what all I got and where all the villagers are coming from. So... I kind of went off and grabbed myself two more villagers. I brought them all the way over here. They were a pain in the butt. Um, I spent most of the morning over here trying my best to get these guys going. Um, hello, good sir. How you doing? See, we got a silk touch book. I got myself, I think I, oh, we came over here to grab one more of those. Yeah. Uh-huh. So, yeah, we got ourselves another silk touch book off of this dude over here. Um, he's a novice. He's just learning. He's just learning his place. Um, we got this dude over here. He has unbreaking. Um, dude, dude, could you come forward, please? Thank you so very much. He got unbreaking three, but he's a little bit on the expensive side. Um, it does. It, it is only one book, but still, I mean, really, he, he is a little bit on the expensive side for me. But I'll go ahead and let's see here. Any of my tools need unbreaking on them? Um, this does. All right, so we'll grab that for our shovel down here. That we got unbreaking and efficiency. You guys are gonna see something else. Um, I lost a villager that was selling efficiency five. I reset his trade and uh, it was this guy right here now he's just got on breaking three that's okay that's okay mister you're forgiven you better make up for it um we got this guy no i'm sorry um that was this dude he's selling efficiency five haha -ha. see so we got efficiency five right there um we can put that on we we got efficiency four efficiency five we could put that on our work pick possibly but i got an efficiency five book right here i don't know what i want to put that on just yet i'll probably hold on to it for the time being um uh, but yeah this guy he's selling some things i bought one off of him to kind of lock his trades hey my man come over here i think we already did him and this dude over here if he can get off of that thing hey Hey, hey, mister, take a look at this, guys. Uh, diamond tools for days. Um, I sold a lot of my iron to him, and he, he, these guys, they're a pain in the butt. Really, they are. Um, my farmers, I do have a farmer, and I'll take you guys over to him right now. But I can get all the diamond tools that I need. The only thing that we need to do now is just, well, figure out how to get into the... Well, I got to go blow the nether up again, <laughs> to be honest. I have to go through that, and I'm kind of holding off until 
we get the uh, next update. So I got a bunch of diamond tools. Um, I can get all the diamond gear that I need. I don't have to go mining for diamonds anymore. That's nice. You know, um, just get me a fortune three pickaxe now and we'll be good. You know, lots of fortune. We're good. We're good for that then. All right. Um, <laughs> that's all we need. All the fortune in the world, and I don't have to worry about this, you know, working around my work pick anymore. We can just head down here, do all the mining that we need, and we'll be, do we'll be good. Um, I might even start doing some blast mining, too. Uh, here we get all the blocks, so that might be something to look forward to. Um, inside of, no, it's not in there. Um, up inside of our house over here, guys, I'll show you all the tools that I grabbed off of them because I unenchanted all of them for some extra levels so over in here we got ourselves all this stuff and things i re-enchanted one grab this i'm gonna head into this thing right here and we're gonna slap that unbreaking three on this right there and there we are and yeah that's unbreaking three anything else need unbreaking on it this thing looks like it's already going, but it could use like a fortune on it. Really, it could. Um, let's see here. We got silk touch on that. What's it have? Efficiency four. I'm thinking of putting efficiency five on that thing so it can like really rip through the world. Let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> and whenever it comes time to it, then we'll just uh. I mean, let's see what the, let's see how good this thing can do now, okay? Because I've been like really, really, really like anytime I wanted to do some work, this shovel has been like the bane of my butt. Um, my bees are still flying like too far away. Maybe it's a bug to do with that. I don't know. Um, probably got to get them on leads. And I got an iron golem. I got an iron golem. Okay, so up inside of here, guys, I got some villagers. They're up here doing their stuff and things. Um, if I can ever catch one of them to, like, come over in here, I can do a trade with them. Like, this dude right here. Okay, we can do emeralds with this dude. Um, fish. I can, do, like, trade my fish with this dude and get some emeralds. No, not fish for emeralds and stuff and things like that. Um, there are other villagers. They have other trades in here if we can just get to them. There is a farmer in there. Somewhere. Somewhere there's a farmer up in there. <laughs> I don't know why I said it like this. I just didn't want to have to deal with them for the time being. So if they breed, you know, I can reach up here. I can grab one of them and just like, here we go. So this guy right here, I can go ahead and buy myself some, uh, I could buy a, a bucket of cod off of this dude. But I don't want to. I don't want to set their uh, trades completely. Okay, uh, one of these guys up inside of here is a farmer. He's the one up in trading stuff and things with. So we lost out on a lot of pumpkins and melons and you know wheat and stuff and things. But hey, you know what? It's been worth it. And I got lots of emeralds for trading with. Uh, I'm on my way towards that emerald beacon, guys. We're going to get the emerald beacon. I want it. So, ooh, there's a uh, crafting table right behind me. Let's do this. Uh, yeah, give me that. Give me the shiny stuff. Give me the shinies. What do we got? We got 13. All right, so we are definitely on our way to getting some better and better, better stuff for mining, okay? Um, because, let's face it, guys. Let's see. What do we have? We got... Really? All right. I don't know what this crying obsidian is crafted for. I can't remember how what it's what you can use it for crafting with. But let's see here. We're going to go ahead and shove this in there. Shove the unbreaking in there. Um, I think we're set. I think we're set. I think we're set. All right. Let's grab this. Let's head over towards this end. And I told you guys I wanted to build a pumpkin today. So instead of me making pumpkin pie, let's go build a pumpkin. Okay. Let's go build a pumpkin, guys. Let's go build our pumpkin. You know, messing around with this stuff for too long. Let's go see how many pumpkins we got from, uh, well, doing all that stuff and things. And if I can get enough, I'll get a beacon going down below. But we got to go to the nether for that, unfortunately. Um, I really didn't want to, but it looks like we're going to have to. All right. And inside of here, how are we doing? Look at all the pumpkins. All right. I'm going to get this crap out of my inventory. 
Can we? Yeah, there we are. There we are. There we are. There we are. All right, put that there. Give me this. Bada bing, bada boom. Um, set my bed down. I got another bed over here. Why do I have an extra bed? I don't know. All right, let's go. Down we go. All right. Um, let's start with these. Let's get up there. Let's craft these things up into melons because we're gonna need some stems. All right. Let's go ahead. Let's do block. We're gonna need stems, so let's do this. Stems, stems, stems. Yes, I know they're just melons, but we're gonna call them stems because you need a stem to work with, you know what I mean? Let's go ahead, let's grab all that. Boom, boom. All right, let's head up here. Turn these things into some stems because we need them, we need them, we need them, we need them. Oh yeah. Uh, blocks. There we go. Boom. There we are. We're going to go ahead and do this. I wish we can auto-craft these things, but I guess that's going to be kind of hard to do. All right. Let's go ahead. Let's go inside of here. Let's grab all my pumpkins. Eh. I said all the pumpkins. There we go. We'll go ahead and grab all that. Oh, shove this here. Shove that there. And just toss that inside of there. I kind of want a little bit of juice. Can I have some juice? Can I have a little tasty taste of some juice while I'm out here? You know, I'm eating some pumpkin. Maybe I'll have some watermelon too. Nice and tasty. Up. Ooh, that reminds me. I don't think I added that data pack in here yet. I kind of want to work on that still. All right, so the stems, guys. All right, let's go ahead. Let's bring this thing down. Let's bring this in. Um, I want to beef this up maybe a little bit more. Um, push this into the ground. Bring it out maybe like this. Boom, boom, boom. All right, we got the stem in here. We got the stem. So the stem's gonna kind of work its way up. We're gonna have a little chunk of wood in here. Um, all right, boom. All right, I want this to work its way up to the top of the pumpkin. So we're gonna have to get that pumpkin built. Let's get some CP seeps. Let's see what we can do about the shape of this pumpkin. Cause you guys are wondering, how's this pumpkin gonna work out? I wonder, what's this pumpkin going to look like? Well, I kind of want the pumpkin to come out. You know, it's it's not going to look like a regular pumpkin, okay? We're going to kind of shape this thing to kind of look like it's it's going to it's not going to look natural, okay? Not like the ones you're probably used to seeing. This thing's going to look different, all right? I'm going to go ahead. I want to fill this in right here because I don't want nothing spawning on top of this right here, okay? There we go. Let's go ahead. Let's fill this in right here. And we're going to go ahead just drag it out just a wee little bit. Let's grab this. Bring this. Bring it over just a wee little bit. And we're just going to make the pumpkin kind of work its way up. Make. I don't want it to be 100% natural. So we're going to kind of do something like this. And I want to work this thing up the entire way around. And we're going to bring the stem up again like this. Bring it up and over. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to drag this thing around like so. And maybe add a little bit more stem in here. Add that. And a little bit more of this. We're going to mix in some shroom lights in with this thing too. All right, let's go ahead. Let's bring this thing out. We're going to add, I need a little bit more pumpkin juice. All right, let's get that pumpkin juice in there, guys. Let's see here. 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 Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Bring it down. Ooh, All right, we're out. We're down. We're down. We're down. Yeah, there we go. Let's bring this thing across. We're just going to do it random because we don't want our, we want our pumpkin to look like it's, like this thing is fresh. Okay. I, I don't want it to look like it's shaped. All right. I want it to look like we, we can shape it up a little bit. Okay. We can shape it up a little bit. All right. We can shape it up just a little bit to make it look like it is like a real natural pumpkin. But for right now, I just want to kind of get the shape of this thing going like that. Here we go. Yeah, kind of like that, kind of like that. I want to get the overall shape of this thing going. Like this thing right here, if I lay something on top of it right now, it's not going to work out right. So let's go ahead, let's drag this thing over, and let's do another row. 
because we're doing twos here. We're doing twos. We're doing twos for a reason. It's because this thing is awfully thick. There we are. Boom. All right. All right. Bring this thing down. All right. Uh, maybe I'm going to add a little stem action in over here. We'll bring this one back about over in this side. Um, let's do one here and one over here. And beef this one up like right about over here because it's like right smack dab up against this thing right here. Let's go ahead and pull this thing out. There we are, like that. And we're gonna pull this thing in. We're gonna do one of them. We're gonna pull this jack o' lantern out. We're gonna do that. Bam, bam. And oh, oh, oh. Uh, maybe we can pull this piece out. Let's give it a little contrast to that. Let's hop up here. And let's see if we can do it. Boink. Boink. All right, let's do a little bit of orange. Again, we're gonna up here, we're gonna be bringing it up and bringing it over, all the way over. So I want the stems to connect. So we're gonna have the stem over here. I want a total of three stems. So the three stems that are going to connect are basically, I want this stem over here because we're going to connect this and have it shoot out and go over that way, okay? I need a dispensing system for that first though, okay? So back here on this side, what we can do is we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna boom, boom, bring this out by two. Like that, all right, let's bring this one across. Whoop. Yeah, that's okay, that's okay, that's okay. And maybe we do add a little bit of a stem over here, like, you know, kind of, and no, 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 no. All right, wait, all right. Let's drop this one down in here, make it look like it's going down into the ground, possibly. See where that thing is, like right there? Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe we do add a little bit of a stem over here on this side. Let's see here, can we do that? Add a little bit of a stem over here possibly? Make it look like it's like rooting its way up along the sides. And we'll just go ahead and shove this thing inside of there. Uh, hopefully I'm not messing this thing up, but you guys are getting the general idea. You see how this thing is starting to shape up in here? Whoa! All right, here we go. Um, yeah, it's shaping up nicely now. All right, um, what do we put in here? I think I want to put like maybe one of those, but it isn't going to match up because that thing's right there. All right, let's do this and let's bring this one down and let's do a little bit more work. Um, I wasn't expecting on doing that. All right. Um, if that's going to do that, then we're going to do this. No, not there. There we are. There we are. There we are. There we are. All right. So we got this big beefy stem over here on this side. I know it kind of looks a little bit funky right now. All right. Let's see what we can do about fixing this up now. Our pumpkin's starting to look a little bit um, leafy. All right, think of that as like the leaf. But uh, we're gonna add some more leaves like on top of this thing. I wanna add leaves on it. So let's go ahead, let's see what we can do about getting the shape of this thing going now. All right. Let's go ahead, let's get this one up here. And pick block doesn't work for me in case you're wondering why I'm doing that. I still can't figure that part out. It's aggravating me to be honest. All right, let's see here. Let's do this, do this, and ah, it didn't go the way I wanted it to. That's okay. That's okay. All right. Alright, 
up here we're going to go ahead we're going to drag this across like right in this area and we're going to give this pumpkin kind of a uh, kind of a look that whoops uh from the outside okay we just want to kind of make this thing kind of look like it's going up like in this area you see how this thing is going up like right here all right i want to kind of bring this up maybe by two and then drown it down by one so we're going to go ahead we're going to do that right here then we're going to boom bring it across like that and then bring this across I want this pumpkin not to look 100% perfect, okay? It's not going to look perfect. I don't want anything of this pumpkin to look perfect. All right, maybe we do a little bit more here. We bring this one up maybe by two. And let's do another two maybe right there. All right, let's go ahead and bring this across. And let's put the rest of this pumpkin together now, guys. Boom, boom. Um, and I'm just placing these things random and now if you guys can see so hopefully nothing f falls out in here w like me okay I'm gonna go ahead and drop down in here because I want to put some extra torches in here just to be on the safe side whoa okay I thought something spawned in here all right yeah that's just me okay I spawned in here boop 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 okay and do that bada bang Bada boom, and right up here on the tip of the pumpkin, we're gonna do one of them, like I so. And boop, boop. And we got this dead center piece right here. Now, I got a dark oak log. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna swap that out for one of these, a couple of melons. Bring that up. Um, I wanna swap that and do this. We're gonna knock this bottom one out like that and let me see here let me see here all right we came up by two see about going up and then boop like that all right let's see what this looks like all right so this is our leaf this is our leaf that comes off of this all right it looks a little bit funky right now but let's just get down here let's put this piece inside of here like so i'm gonna go ahead and put a light on this thing and let's get down and let's see what else we can do to this thing so this is our pumpkin so far okay yeah, we got this piece over here we still need to fix up add a little bit more jack-o-lanterns to it well not that a little bit something more to kind of fix it up you know it can't look like this the entire time so let's go ahead let's add these in here bring these things across because we don't want that all right we don't want that um, I do want to add a melon right here I do want to add a melon right there add one right there there and right over here on this side we gotta bury it now okay we gotta bury this but I still need a way to get in there you see a spot right there and a spot right there now this pumpkin it doesn't quite look like one to you probably but not all pumpkins, they, not all pumpkins look the same, okay? Not all pumpkins look the same. Some of them look different, some of them, you know, they're just, whoops. All right, there we go. Um, <laughs> not all pumpkins look the same, guys. You just have to kind of use your imagination. Yeah. Can you get in there? There we go, we got it. All right, let's go ahead and shove this thing right about in here. Um, you right here, you right there, there, all right, we'll put this thing in like right in this spot right here, I'm going to go ahead and put another, you know, just kind of randomize these things right over in this area, like this, and maybe we'll put one like right here, there we go, and let's see what we can do about shaping this area up now, all right, because we do need this watermelon patch to work, all right, so... Let's see here. Can we kind of like bring this piece in like right here? Do something like that right there. Do that. Um, add this in. Add this in. Boom, boom, boom. All right. Hopefully this doesn't mess with the redstone. I'm really hoping it don't. So I'm going to go ahead and add that in right there. Boom. And we're going to add a little. No, let's not add that in there. Boom, boom and we still got our area for getting downstairs 
that's pretty good all right let's go ahead and see if we can chunk that off like right there okay so we still got ourselves an access door right here what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna pull this piece off right here because i should still be able to get out of here i'm gonna look you get up yeah you can bounce right out all right so we just need a trap door for right there all right what can we do for a trap door guys let's see here well what matches best with the dirt spruce well i do have a bunch of that so let's see here which one of these did i put it all in well, we got some right here. That should work. Let's see here. And I do know where I put it all at. I put it right here. Okay, let's go ahead and grab three of these. I said three. Boom. Let's go ahead and do one of those because I do need a whole bunch of these because I want to fix that up. So we're going to use this. Let's take this thing. We're going to go boop right there. Yeah, that works. That works. That works. I think this don't look half bad. Uh, we got this melon right here. It seems to stick out of place. So let's fix that with a couple of these. Um, anything else? Let's see here. Um, maybe this one needs to come out. It just seemed like completely out of place there for a moment. What's this one? Can we do something with that? Eh, it's a melon of a different flavor. <laughs> it's a melon of a different flavor, guys. Well, not a melon of a different flavor. It's a pumpkin. Um, <laughs> maybe adding a little bit more of those shroom lights in through it would kind of mix it up. Or we can go bury this. Let's go find out. Um, give me this and let's get up there and let's go find out. If we put these up here, is there a way up there? Yes, there is. All right, let's go bury those. Nope, those are for the inside. So here we go. Boom, boom. Oh, we forgot to bury this. Nice eye. Nice eye. All right. Um... There we go. All right, so we do need a little bit of dirt. We got that right here. And we're going to head over here to this side where we were putting this in, this stem. And what I want to do is I just want to kind of bury this and keep it natural at the same time. So let's just go ahead and do something like that for this. Eh. Yeah, that kind of works. It just kind of works right there. Uh, give me Give me this. Yeah, that'll work. Put a little extra grass in that. Yeah, I think that'll work. It looks a little bit awkward in some places, but it's a melon, guys. It's a melon. Well, not a melon. It's a pumpkin. <laughs> Put that in there. <laughs> we got a pumpkin, guys. We got a pumpkin. Let's go ahead, let's shear this bottom piece off right here. Let's make that a solid underneath. Boom, boom, boom. Like so, maybe. And... Now, it did kind of look a little bit better like that. Yeah, I guess so. Awkward is always better. Awkward is always better. <laughs> you guys let me know what you think. <laughs> let me know what you guys think in the comments below. But, uh, pumpkin for a day. <laughs> I'll see y'all next time. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the build of this pumpkin, and I'll see you all on the flip side. We still got ourselves another melon to build, and we need to figure out how to get the water flowing going for this. Um, I got some blue ice. I got some packed ice. The villagers are being very nice to me, and those wandering traders, well, let's just say I got myself about eight heads. Um <laughs> I'll see y'all next time. Later.